Hello everyone. I'm sorry it's been so long that I haven't posted a video. We've all been very ill. At first I was in quite a bad ME flare and I didn't really have the energy to do a lot of anything at all. And then as I was just recovering from that flare, I came down with like a cold flu virus that Dexter had caught and decided to share his germs with me. And so it's been a long time since I've been able to pick up the camera and I do apologise for that. So because of that, literally everywhere in the house is a complete and utter pigsty. There is stuff everywhere. I'm feeling stressed to say the least because I've just got stuff everywhere and I really need to get back to it with actually like being ruthless and over the next few videos I'm going to be trying to get my house back into order without burning myself out hopefully. So today I am doing my autumn winter wardrobe because I am desperate to get my wardrobe switched out, I've still got most of my summer clothes in there. I pulled the box of autumn and winter clothing out so that I could have something warm to wear and I've just been taking stuff out of that and so I've got clothes everywhere at the moment but I'm also desperate to get rid of some clothes as well so what I want to do is I've got a charity bag here and then I've got an empty Calax box so I'm going to put maybe stuff in my Calax box I'm going to put stuff that I want to get rid of in this charity bag and then all of my summer clothing is going to go into this storage box until next spring summer until the weather warms up again and then i'm going to do the same with dexter's wardrobe the bed is just like covered in stuff outside and on the landing is just stuff everywhere dexter's clothes the halloween stuff that we've got out of the cupboard and everything is just everywhere at the moment and because I've been so ill and like stuck in this flare I've just had no energy to like do anything at all so Ben is downstairs with Dexter currently because he is visiting today so I'm gonna see what I can get done in my wardrobe at the very least and see if I can get some order in here because it's again a bit of a mess. I've already pulled some stuff out that was down the bottom here. I've got a lot of stuff that I just need to go through, basically. And then I've got to do the same with Dexter's wardrobe. So I pulled out Dexter's winter clothes and the majority of them I think are too small for him. So a lot of them are like two to three years and some of them just don't fit him at all. So I need to go through that. There is a box down here. Just excuse the mess. I feel like my house is always just going to be in a state of chaos at the moment. I've got to stop saying that because I feel like if I keep saying that I'm never going to get anywhere with it. I've just got to like get myself back into the zone of getting my stuff together really because I'm getting quite sick to death of being surrounded by so much stuff. So I'm going to put you guys over here where hopefully you can see what i'm doing as you know if you've been here for a while this room is so awkward to sort of like position the camera in a place where you can see me i think i'm going to start by just taking literally everything out of the wardrobe and i know i'm going to regret this because i've already got stuff everywhere but i feel like realistically it's the only the only way I can do this is because I need to empty this box get all my winter stuff out I want to only put back in here stuff that is like wintery because it is getting cold now here and we're having a lot of rainy days a lot of windy days and yeah it's just time to switch out the wardrobe it's been time for a while but I just haven't had the energy I know I said in like one of my last videos I wasn't gonna say that I haven't had the energy but it's true um, the energy has not been with me. I'm still trying to get in the habit of saying that. The energy is not with me, which my mum told me to say instead of I haven't got the energy. But it's hard. It's really, really hard. And I'm trying my best. But yeah, I've got to get sorted because this house is doing my head in. I don't think I can spend like another four years trying to declutter my home. I've just got to really be 
ruthless now so i think i'm gonna have a lot of maybes because i want to try and narrow my wardrobe down to like 30 items and i know i've said this in other wardrobe videos that i really want to narrow it down to 30 items so i think in my past videos i've got about 50 items in both my summer and winter wardrobe so that's like a hundred maybe even more items of clothing and i feel like nobody needs that much but like it's a real struggle so i think what i'm gonna do is see if i can do like a 30 item wardrobe and see if i can actually like live with a 30 item wardrobe for a while and see where we go from there i think a lot of it is like trial and error and currently because my i'm like sort of i feel like i'm like sort of in between sizes at the moment because i've lost a small amount of weight but then as soon as i think i'm oh yeah i'm losing weight i gain it back so clothes at the moment are just really awkward i'm gonna stop rambling on and try and make a start on there because i feel like i'm procrastinating already because i like to do that procrastinate because i just don't want to get on with it <laughs> Okay, that's one completely empty wardrobe and now I'm not feeling this because I've thrown everything on the floor. Oh, I feel like I need some music. There's so many fish in the ocean, they say. So when will the wind blow you my way is how to make shy love is how to make shy love so let's pretend that we can do this so let's pretend that we can cause it's how to make shy love Wishing the right direction will lead me One wish in the right direction to you I'm leaving empty space for lovers I'm leaving empty space for you Honestly, I'm really struggling because I really honestly like most of my clothes, even my summer clothes well, I like more of my summer clothes than I do my winter clothes and most of them I could probably get rid of because I'm just not overly keen on most of the clothing that I've got in here. Also, I'm struggling because I've got so much stuff and I'm trying to work out. I, gen I genuinely feel like I could narrow my, da my wardrobe down to 30 items, definitely. There are things here that, so there's some things I've started filling this box, this maybe box with stuff. So there are things in there that I haven't worn this summer, things in there that probably don't fit me because I think the jeans, there's a pair of skinny jeans in there that just, I think they fit me but they're very tight and just uncomfortable and so um most of that i need to like try on probably and decide i'll probably get rid of most of it and i will probably just charity most of it but like winter wise i feel like i've got barely anything i need long sleeve t-shirts i've only got one pair of jeans because my other pair i think i've got a black pair of jeans actually so i've got two pairs of jeans and I've got one pair of jeans that are have got holes in them, so they're like more for summer. I'm just trying to decide like what I put back in this wardrobe. And a couple of items that I've had out for summer could be winter items as well. 
and I know that I've got some stuff in the wash basket that is like mainly summer clothes but there might be like a couple of long sleeve t-shirts in there so I'm not going to go out and buy like anything at all until I know 100% like what I've got everything's washed and I can see like what I've got but I genuinely feel the majority of my wardrobe I could get rid of and just start again because I hate most of it this is a struggle I've had since I had Dexter. Just gonna sit down for a minute. This is a struggle I've had since I had Dexter. Like I've really struggled with my wardrobe and clothing and what I look and feel nice in. And it's been it's been a real struggle ever since becoming a mum. I feel like I never really cared as much about my wardrobe before I had Dexter as I care about it now. Which is not a great thing. And I feel like I've just really struggled to like find my style as a mother because I don't, the way that I used to dress is not the way that I feel like I should dress now. And so I just really struggle with, have major wardrobe dilemmas basically. Anyways, as usual, I'm not really counting loungewear, but I am gonna count everything that I've hung up and probably everything I put in here because this is going to be t-shirts so far I've only got one vest in there and I need I think I've got a couple more vests laying around because in the winter I like to layer up because it gets so cold here that I like to wear a vest underneath so I tend to like keep my vest tops out as well as long sleeve tops and I don't think I'm going to put any short sleeve tops in here but I just don't know don't you to me too So don't worry It was always overdue I'm watching your lights as you pull away Playing back all our yesterdays Okay, don't mind the background noise that is throwing Ben or in here. I have quite the pile of washing down there. Most of which is summer clothes and a couple of winter items as well. So realistically this isn't going to be real but I've counted everything that's hanging up and in this drawer and there are Oh, I've lost count now. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 items, 27 with what I'm wearing. And then there's a few like bits. So realistically, there's probably more than 30 items, but I'm going to go through and see if I can just like create outfits at some point when I've washed all of the stuff that's down there 
but that is my wardrobe finished for today and i have a huge box here full of stuff that is potentially gonna go as well so i've managed to fit all of my summer stuff in the box down here i will show you what my wardrobe is looking like currently so that's my hanging stuff, summer stuff in that box down there, washing. Uh, not going to show you that drawer because that's my underwear, but t-shirts, leggings, and pyjamas, which I don't really count loungewear. I've got a wash basket full downstairs, so realistically, I need to get some washing done and then come back and revisit it. But I have finally got my autumn winter wardrobe out and put away my summer stuff so I can finally find clothes that I need to wear. I have a box full of clothes here from, so some of them I saved from like last year because I thought he may fit in them but realistically I don't think he will. Most of the sizes I think are two to three but the three to four stuff I'm gonna put in his wardrobe. I'm gonna take anything out that's like really summery because he's just not gonna he's not gonna want to be wearing like summer clothes like shorts and things like that now. I may leave out a couple of short sleeve tops but not many. I'm just gonna get to it because I'm feeling a little bit tired now. Right I'm gonna start by going through this box of clothes and organizing what is potentially going to fit him what isn't a bit of a struggle because Dexter's got all of his lemon toy boxes out which is for airplanes city lights and hazel eyes well maybe I'll try and wear your shoes and walk the miles you made me lose feeling blackish blue on a road without you and oh you're holding on my to go when I wanted Stay sheltered in the warm of your soul Breaking through the cold Beckon your bones to come home I couldn't see a thing when I lived Safe within the still of the storm I'm looking back with 2020 vision And I know I missed it A mirror of memories looking back Pieces of us in a looking glass Clear as daylight Piercing through an autumn sky I was drowning in a sea of black and white Lost in a maze of wrong and right But the colors changed Underneath the waves And oh, you're holding all my blood in your heart And now I'm wading through the love that I lost shove those coats down there for a minute. I found one of my t-shirts in with your stuff. That's funny, isn't it? I'll just talk to the camera. Okay, and I'll just put this away. So, I mean, okay, I so I have popped all of Dexter's winter clothes in his wardrobe. I'll just show you what it's looking like. His dressing gowns for now I've just shoved on the bottom because it's a, a bit of a, a faff. But he's got long sleeve tops, trousers, you know, wintry things. I'm going to go now and have a rest because I'm not feeling too great. Tomorrow, I've got to take the rabbit to the vets. So, and that's a whole other story, which I will fill you in on another video. But now I have finished that. I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one when we're gonna sort this house out i mean it look it's looking slightly better than it was when i first turned the camera on
but it's it's a work in progress. 